you this morning. Come let us adore him. Kneel down before him. Thank you. 
Yeah. 
It is Jesus. It always will be Jesus. Hallelujah. It doesn't matter what the sales are. The true gift will always be Jesus. So we have to make sure that we always tell somebody. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Listen, I see. We have, first we have our, our eldest. Our eldest kid is in the house. Amen. We love you, Justin. Amen. Raise your hand. For those of you not know you, that's our eldest. I see, I see somebody who has not been in this house in a long time. Sister Lisa, we love you. Hallelujah. Amen. Welcome home, Sister Lisa. Amen. Father God, that you touch their hearts 
God. Pan their minds, God. Give them peace on this morning, God. Fill them up with joy, Father God, and excitement about what they have for you, God. Because we're so grateful to have them here, God. And we're excited to hear from them on this morning. So we thank you, God, and we praise you for each and every one of them. In Jesus' name. Let's go to Bethlehem. Let's see 
this thing that has happened which the Lord has told us about. They hurried to the village and found Mary and Joseph, and there was the baby lying in the manger. After seeing him, the shepherds told everyone what had happened and what the angel had said to them about this child. All who heard the shepherd's story were astonished, but Mary kept all these things in her heart and thought about them all. The shepherds went back to their flocks, glorifying and praising God. For all they had heard and seen, it was just as the angels had told them. Eight days later, when the baby was circus, circumcised, he was named Jesus, the name given by the angel even before he was convinced. Facebook Live will be back with the survey in five minutes. 